South Carolina is home to one of the only game fish untampered with in the country, commonly known as the red eye bass. News 19's Rachel Rip tells us more. Fish and fishing, two of Will Mundhanke's greatest passions. He's an aquatic education specialist for the South Carolina Department of Natural Resources. I think it's the number one bridge to get people connected into the outdoors and one of the easiest routes for folks that may not have a background in the great outdoors, actually going out and participating in it. Columbia and South Carolina are fishermen's havens with the Saluda River, the Congaree, the Broad, ponds, and of course, the Savannah River drainage, home to one particular bass that's one of two native black bass in the state. A fish that's in need of conservation so they don't suffer from hybridization from spotted bass and go extinct. Beyond catch and release and leaving nature where it is, Will and his team at SCDNR are using genetics for conservation efforts. We take a fin clipping, usually of the tail fin, and we put it in a little vial and we're able to run genetic testing on that to find out where our remaining pure populations of Bartram's bass still are what we need to do to protect them, what barriers in the water might be creating these isolated pockets. The red-eye bass has survived even through generational changes to its habitats. Will says everyone can do their part to keep them swimming. Reporting in Columbia, Rachel Ripp, News 19 WLTX.